comma a you have one comma five then we are given also the last term so this is what we have for the a part one comma five comma dash 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 and last term is given as 69 last term is given as 69 then we have our b we have minus six we have minus five over two we have minus six we have minus five over two and we have the last term as 71 so the question asks us to look to to find the first second and last term so we have to look for the first term the second term okay we are given the first term the second term and the last term so the question gave us the first term the first term is given the second term is given and the last term is given for the respective a and b the question now asks us to look for find the common difference and the number of terms so the question asks us to look for d which is the common difference and the number of terms which is n so these are the two parameters that the question asks us to look for and we cannot use any other formula other than the un which is the last term which which says that un is a plus n minus 1 d here our first term with respect to the a our first term is given as 1 while the common difference can also be the the deduce which is d equals 5 minus 1 which is 4 then the last term is also given which is un and that is 69 so automatically we can calculate our common difference our common difference has been calculated common difference common difference is equal to 4 and since we have calculated our common difference, the next thing to calculate is the number of terms. And if you are calculating the number of terms, we have UN as the given, which is the last term, that's 69, equal to A. What is our A? Our A is 1 plus N. That is what we want to calculate. Then we know our common difference to be 4. So 69 equals to 1 plus 4N minus 4. So 69 equals to 4n, 1 minus 4, that is minus 3. So if you collect like terms, if you collect like terms, automatically 4n will be equal to 69 plus 3. And that is 4n will be equal to 69 plus 3, and that is 72. That is 72. 4n equals to 72. Then we divide both sides by 4. We divide both sides by 4. And when we divide both sides by 4, we have our n to be 18. So that means for the a part, the, the, uh, the common difference is 4. And the number of terms is 18. So the B part, the B part, in the B part, it can be deduced that our A is minus 6. Then our common difference, which is the second term minus the first term. So here, the second term is minus 5 over 2, while the first term is minus 6, so minus minus 6. So that gives minus 5 over 2 plus 6. So we look for the SEM here, which is 2. 2 in this, 2. 2 in this, 1. 1 times minus 5, minus 5. Plus 2 in this, eh, 1 in this, 2. 2 times 6, that gives 12. So minus 5 plus 